Hello, welcome back to another video. This is a little vlog, it's a day in the life. It is bank holiday, it is May the 1st, Monday, May the 1st. Atticus is off school, so we are going to, we're going to London for the day. Thought we'd pop to London, have a night. Well, I did give him the choice, actually. I thought he can choose, so I, I said to him, right, we could go Cambridge for the day, where I would have drove, or um, London. He chose London. Um, so we're just going to have a nice chill day in London. And we and haven't got anything planned as such. We're just going to just have a nice chill day. Mm. So first stop is going to be Regent Street, Oxford Street. We're going to have a look at the like combination decorations. Um, we've seen some of them on the telly. There's quite a few. There's all like the Union Jacks hanging down and Atticus wants to have a look at that. Might have a look in a few shops. Um, weather's meant to be nice as well Ooh, we're moving weather's meant to be nice in um, London 18 degrees today um, which is quite nice so yeah let's go to London on a bank holiday Monday is it Just come out of Liberty, how nice was Liberty? It was my first time in there. Um, obviously Atticus's first time. Such a gorgeous department store. So nice. I didn't buy anything. In actual fact, the only thing I did buy, and that's because Atticus bought something, was I got a Liberty shoe bag to put all the shopping in and whatever today, and also I'll use it for my food shop. Um, but that was it, but some lovely, lovely things. Um, Atticus got a London quiz book in there, which he is currently testing me on. A uh, little side street just off Carnaby Street. It's so quiet, really nice and quiet at the moment. It's about 11 o'clock. We were in Liberty quite a while because it's a lovely department store to look around. One of the questions Atticus just asked me out his London quiz book is, what is the wettest capital in Europe? I actually thought it would be London because of the weather we get here. But actually, it was what, Atticus? Norway. Norway. Oslo. There you go, Oslo, Norway. There you go, there you go. The wettest city in Europe. So we have now come to, not that I particularly want another coffee, but I will get a tiny one because we've wanted to come here for quite a while. Um, it is the attendant coffee shop, which is in old Victorian toilets. Um, it sounds gross, but actually it looks really cool. I think it took them something like, was it 30 years, Atticus, to clean the toilets? 
and or something. Non-stop cleaning. Yeah. Would, like, yeah. And when you go in, there's all like the urinals and all, all different sorts. Yeah. So we're going to go in and check out having a coffee in old Victorian toilets. Let's go. Sun has come out in London. It's about midday now. It's so nice and so quiet. How cool was that? The attendant coffee shop. What do you think? It was really good. <laughs> it was really cool. Very small, a lot smaller than I thought, but um, it was cool. And because I bought some coffee beans, I got a free latte, so bonus. So we are now heading to um, Trafalgar Square area. Let's see if we can walk up the Mall. I said to Atticus, I think it's going to be shut in prep for the coronation, which is in four days. I don't think we're going to be able to walk up there. But obviously if we can, then we will. But yeah, lovely, nice chilled bank holiday Monday in London. I had um, lamb sausages with um, potatoes and tomatoes and gravy. It was so good. That was at a pub called The Clarence. Um, we did eat here before um, when we came quite a few months ago. It's really good. Really recommend The Clarence um, down by Horse Guards off Trafalgar Square. Really good, wasn't it, Atticus? So now I am so tired. I change. I am flagging. I am really flagging doing well with my I don't know if I've mentioned I don't think I have in my vlogs which I haven't but the last couple of weeks um, I've had quite a bit of dental work done um, root canals all that stuff and then on Friday Friday just gone I had actually a tooth extraction and a filling and obviously at the time it's all numbed you can't feel it at the time but afterwards it's quite sore and everything else and makes you feel quite tired and everything as well but I've done pretty well today because I've actually only took one painkiller before we left whereas like first day but I, the first day after I'd had it done I was I think I took about four four or five so it is gradually getting better but um I just think you're feeling pretty tired um yeah it takes a few days to feel back to normal really after you've had your tooth out which I didn't expect um but yeah so we are gonna walk up to horse guards and then walk up the mall um so i'll show you that and then we've got to be back at st pancras in about three hours so are you ready atticus yeah i'm blow i'm so tired now i've had that meal i'm ready for a nap You can see how they've started prepping for the combination. Obviously, it's little horse guards, Got all the seats out, all the barriers have been put up already, all over the mall. So we're just walking down the mall, and you can see um, the centre is just, closed off. You can't just, walk down the centre. I just but told Mummy like what I think will be all the protection. It's going to be so much security, there isn't there? I feel like Walking at the mall, um, and as you can see, you can see that light blue thing in the background. That is, no, we're not going to video them, but that is people already camping out so they get their spot. Yeah, today is Monday, and the combination is on Saturday, four days in advance. Then people are getting their spot. Dedication, dedication, right there. First time for everything and we have now seen a black swan. I have never seen a black swan in my life. I just heard somebody say, God, never seen a black swan before. I'm like, okay, where's the black swan? Oh, it is over there, you can see it. Oh yeah. 
all the television um, channels have set up there they've done like a walking system around the palace you can't just like walk up to it you have to like walk quite a way around to get to it <sighs> and we are on the train it is just gone five o'clock um it's got about 10 15 minutes till it pulls off we've had it haven't we ask us very very tight we've done a lot Hello. It was a nice little bank holiday, London. Did you enjoy it, Atticus? Yes. It was great seeing all the like the coronation prep. That was really good because obviously you know we're not going to be here next weekend. Um, so it was nice to see the prep and you know get in the spirit a little bit. The one to add to your collection. This is a lovely one, actually, Atticus. That is lovely. Yeah, that's a lovely one. Lovely bears, isn't it? I got myself a little thing from Oliver Boat Festival. This is so pretty to go on my dressing table. Like a glass tray with all the little flowers. Um, I'm actually going to put my perfumes on this. It's so pretty. Absolutely loved it. Sun came out 